<laughs> Mafia, my ass. I'll get this guy out of your hair. Pay you back, no, bro. No, don't try anything. The Chief already has a deal worked out with them. We need to do what the Chief wants. But... Just stay quiet. Shit. Do you even have enough money to pay him? 2,000 yen? No, not even close. Damn it. And I only have enough to cover myself. Look, you better hide in there. I'll think of it. Fuck. Hello, Namba-chan. Is it ever good when you're homeless? No, oh, no. You'll never make it back to proper society with that attitude. Besides, you got a sweet deal going on. Sleeping and drinking all day must be nice. You're right. I'm sorry. <laughs> Namba, does this box belong to you? Yeah, I needed to pick up a few things. <laughs> What kind of things? Hey, let's have a look. Oh, hold on. Can't a guy have a little privacy? You live on the street. People like you don't get to have privacy. <laughs> Stop! Don't open it! Hey, how's it going? Well, Namba-san, you tried to play nice, but you know what? Fuck these guys. Who the hell are you? The fine people here have been taking care of me since yesterday. I see. Does that mean you live in one of these fucking tents here? If so, we'll be taking your rent up front, cash only. Yeah, Sucks right. for you, I'm broke. And if I weren't, I wouldn't even give you my pocket change. <laughs> Wow, Namba. Not only did you bring in some cocky asshole, but then you tried to keep him as your little secret from us. I'm gonna make sure you pay for that one later. Hey, Namba-san saved my life. Get your hands off him! Ah, look who thinks he's a tough guy. Every now and then, we get a newcomer like you doesn't know his place. You guys bark loud, but you never got the bite to back it up. You go down whimpering like bitches every time. Put up your goddamn fists. Let's see if you're any different from the rest of this trash. Don't try to stop me, Namba-san. Stop you? Hmm. At this point, he's gonna kill us both and dump us in the river. But before that, I'm gonna stick this up his ass! <laughs> Come on, Namba! This dumbass give you big ideas? I'll break so many of your bones you won't be able to beg anymore! <laughs> Alright, let's do this! Get this shit over with! I'm not a loser! Yeah. You wanna fight? Come on! Come on now! Yeah! yeah. Let's go! Have fun with this! Watch this! Check this out! Come on now! Okay. Have fun with this. Watch this. I got this. You're fucking weak. Yeah. Check this out! Come on now! Ready? 
cool. Check this out. Going down. Come on now. I'm in the Yokohama Leomang. <laughs> you know, I was doing some calculations back there. 2,000 yen from each bum gets you about 100k. My math's not great, but you talk pretty big for a guy collecting chump change. You wanna die, asshole? That's what you're- I'll give you one chance to apologize to me. Sounds like the empty threat of a loser. Last chance. Apologize now if you wanna live. Did you hear? I ain't apologizing for shit. You're gonna regret this. Your bark is worse mm -hmm. than your bite. Tell me, why would I regret it? You gonna sick your big, tough Liu Mong boys on me? Do they even have any of them? Fuck you! We're the strongest Chinese mafia in Yokohama! Trust me, your buddies are shitting themselves. They know what's coming. Okay, so I take it all the big boys you'll be sending in to put us in our place are better fighters than you? You fucking! No, seriously, when should we expect them? When are you gonna tell them you got beat up by hobos scrounging for pocket change? How are they gonna take that? Oh, our boy Zhang got his ass kicked. And then what? They're gonna rally the fucking troops for you? Your officers can't be that bored. You'll just end up the shame of the Liu lame. <laughs> Do you ever shut the fuck up? That's just how these things go. A gangster like you should know that. Officers don't just go out and save their minions from every little street fight. Damba, I'll deal with your pants ass later after I take care of your new meat shield. Hey, shut up. This isn't even Liu Mang turf. Oh, seriously? <laughs> so you have even less leverage than I thought, Zheng Chan. Yeah. Oh, yeah? I don't know a lot about Yokohama, but I'm sure the gangs here are real strict. If you're waltzing across the border to shake us down, isn't that a turf violation? <laughs> So not only did you get whipped by bums, you were trespassing. Honestly, man, I wouldn't even report this one if I were you. Unless you want to make your whole gang a joke. <laughs> You're a fucking shithead. It's hard being the bottom rung of the ladder, isn't it? I can relate to that, actually. Difference is, I learned not to bully people who are weaker than me. Shut up! I'm letting you off easy today. Let's go! Hey, bring us something to eat next time, would ya? Oh. That was way out of line. No, we don't have to be scared of that asshole anymore. <laughs> You pull something like that again, I'm tossing you out on the street. Our priority is to have somewhere to sleep tomorrow. Don't you dare put that at risk again. He's not really that mad at you. I should have. No. You did what was right. And hey, I got to vent some bottled up anger of my own. I'm sure most of the guys here would agree with me. No, you don't have to thank me. I gotta say. You're a professional at pissing people off. Huh? Um, that's not exactly a skill I want to have. 
Maybe not. But then again, maybe being a pain in the ass is just part of your charm, you know? Huh. Well, I never thought about it like that before. So, hey, I guess the Chinese Mafia is some big deal in Yokohama, huh? Not just the Chinese. The city is sliced up among the east. Eugene three? Yep. The three girl games. in the red shoes left with four and on a steamship from Yokohama. So here we go. The Zheng guy was from the Chinese Mafia, known as the Yokohama Lumon. It's over here is the Korean Mafia. They go by the same name as the area they occupy. Jewel. And of course, there's the Japanese Yakuza. They're called the Seiryu clan. But to the locals, they're all known as the Ijin Three. I'm guessing the Seiryu clan is under the umbrella of the Omi Alliance? You hmm. kidding? No, they've always been independent, and they're happy to let you know it. Are the Omi in Ijin Show? <laughs> the Ijin Three offer the town protection <laughs> from outside forces, in a way. That metaphorical barrier is known as the Great Wall of Muscle. Hell of a metaphor. So, the Eijing Three work together to keep people from... getting over this wall? Work together? <laughs> yeah, right. They're always at each other's throats. Doesn't that mean a war could break out at any moment? Yeah. Guess you could call this a Cold War. What's that? Did you skip that day in history class or something? Okay, Cold War is like a powder keg. Any teensy bit of friction can trigger a huge explosion. Oh, okay. I mean, would you want to stick your hand into a powder keg and risk setting it off? Hell no. Exactly. So, as long as this Cold War is going on, no one can stick their hand into Yokohama. I get it. There's so much tension, everyone's... But it's amazing that there's never been a war on the inside, then. <sighs> yeah, I try not to think about that. They can all be... This city would turn into a goddamn crater if that happened. Maybe there's a reason it hasn't. A secret reason. You ever... Like, what if the Aging Three leaders are pretending there's a Cold War so they can sit back and relax? <laughs> not a chance. Each gang leader is desperate to be the strongest. Everyone knows that. Whatever the opposite of relaxing is, that's what they're doing. They're gathering strength. Which is scary, isn't it? But for the Yokohama underworld, that's just the way things are. Why are you telling me all this? So that I'll be- More or less. You've already been pretty damn lucky. Lucky? Me? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know your traitor patriarch shot you and all. That was unlucky, sure. But then someone brought you here to Yokohama. The one place in all of Kanto where there's no Omi at the moment. A place where they can't even get in. You're safe from them. Hmm. I guess. I don't know how long I can just hang around in Eugene show, though. I'll yeah. go on and leave. Yeah, I think I will. See if I'm lucky. Ow! 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 Oh my God. What the hell is that for? You won't get far with that still healing. You'll be dead in a dead. I could have done without the demonstration. Talking out your ass. It's Ichiban's money. What? Actually, I have no idea how I got this. Ha! Told you it was mine! 
Hey, <laughs> give it back. Uh, <laughs> oh, you teachy John, my old friend. I thought I'd never see your face again. <laughs> Let me just clean you off a bit. Aren't you beautiful? Huh? What the hell? What's wrong? Oh, look at this. <laughs> The back of it is blank, but I think it's just stupid play money. It's a counter. Wait, hold on. <sighs> hmm. well, that's definitely not play money. The front looks way too much like a real bill. I mean, look. It even has a watermark. For real? Well, they wouldn't put watermarks on play money, would they? So you're saying it's real, even though it's half blank? Hey, does that mean it's worth 5,000? Oh, dumbass. It means there's only one thing it could be. It's counterfeit. Oh, what? It's a fake? Hey, you trying to get us all arrested or something? No, that shit's not even mine. You said you just dropped it the other day. What's with that? Do I look like someone who would have that much? I would have spent it already, man. Come on. Obviously. Now cut it out, you two. But it's yours, right? Why did you have it? Why would you bring that shady shit here? We don't want any trouble. Come on, man. This guy's bad news for the whole camp. We can't let him stay here. I say we kick him out. I told you, I don't know where it came from. I don't even know where I'd get a fake bill. Liar! How did it end up in your pocket, then? Wait, wait. Let's think about this for a second. Ichiban's pocket where he had the bill has a huge bullet hole in it. So if the bill was in his pocket at the time he got shot, doesn't that mean it should have a hole in it too? But look, it doesn't. And there's no way Ichiban could have put it in his pocket after he got shot. He was barely even conscious. That could only mean someone must have put it there after he fainted. Who would do that? And why? Don't look at me. I have no freaking idea. It was probably whoever brought him here. You got an idea who did that? Probably not, huh? Nope. It's as much a mystery to me as it is to you guys. I don't know why I got dumped here, and I don't know why I have this bill. Seriously, I don't know a goddamn thing. You've got to believe me. Who cares? Look, we're already on thin ice here, and none of us want to give the police an excuse <laughs> to raid us. So let's just get rid of that thing. Throw it away and stop causing trouble. You two are the ones making a scene. How about I bring this to the chief? Eh, uh, Nanbasan. Don't do us like that. Look, I get it, okay? I'll make you a deal. You take it easy, I won't start any more trouble. We good? Fuck you, man. Oh boy. I shouldn't stay here. But I thought you had nowhere else to go. Well, I don't. But anywhere would be... What? I walked around all damn day, and what good did that do? I mean, there's gotta be tons of jobs out there which pay more than this. There's just gotta be. Yeah, probably. Well, if you think so too, but let's go find one of those. Oh, sure. Got any leads? Know anybody who can give us a reference? How about a resume? Oh, hey, I know. We could find something at Hello Work. Man, easier said than done. Hello Work. Listen up, everyone. Hey, what are you doing? Guys, guys, why are we living like this? Has anybody here ever gone to Hello Work? Eh? Sounds like a big fat no. But you're all perfectly healthy. I've seen some of you build shit. I've seen some of you cook! You have skills! So why aren't you trying to find jobs? Just gotta get up and do it! Come on! You really want to keep living like this just to avoid taking some risks? Don't you see you can change if you want to? Or do you all just want to die here? Well, I don't. I say we go and find some decent jobs! Anyone who whines about it, I don't mind dragging you- Shut the fuck up! Do you seriously think we're all here because we want to be? Nah. You said everyone has their reasons, and I get that, man. But come on, you still gotta try, don't you? Better than living like this, a little effort can land you a job, even if you have a criminal record. 
You don't know what the hell you're talking about. Why not? First of all, only a few of us have criminal records. Most of us didn't do anything wrong. Then why? For some, all they did was co-sign a bad loan. Others worked hard for their families, who abandoned them when they couldn't pay the bills. Nobody lives like this by choice. This isn't somewhere you choose to be, it's somewhere you end up. Do you know what that's like? To end up that broken? <sighs> nope. Some of us have families who are out there looking for us. Parents and kids, hoping we'll come back. And for as much as some of us would love to go back, we can't. Not when we're still so broken. And you think you can fix all that with just a quick trip to Hello Work? They get back on the grid, then all the problems and enemies from their old lives are gonna pop right back up. Did you ever think of that? You think we're just too lazy to work? We all want a job and a living man. But we can't just erase all the things that keep us from having them. So it might not look like much to you, but they're trying! A serious talk from now, but... I'm... sorry. You can't force people to be just like you. So knock it up, but I'll give you this. You're not totally wrong. What? You made a good point about having a criminal record. We do have one felon here lying low. Uh, who? Me. Me. But you said you used to be a nerd. <sighs> it doesn't matter. But maybe I found some motivation in that stupid little speech of yours. <laughs> Enough to try anyway. So, I'll come with you to hello work. I'll see what it's like to take at least the first step out of the gutter. By the way, you've got a pretty crazy tattoo on your back, right? Is it a dragon? No, not no. a dragon. dragon. It's a fish. dragon. F a dragonfish? Yeah, but to be honest, I wanted a real dragon. Wait, then why didn't you get one? In the By the way, you've got a pretty crazy. Is it a dragon? A dragonfish? Yeah, but to be honest, I wanted a real dragon. Wait. Then why didn't you get in the Yakuza business? A dragon symbolizes the top of the food chain. A <laughs> fresh faced fool like me can't just casually rock it. Wow, that's for real? Well, I guess a dragonfish is pretty cool. Right? I'm into it. Someday I want to earn my pl And then my dragonfish is going to shine even brighter than a dragon. <laughs> Dreaming big, huh? In that case, maybe I ought to start by finding a job. Yeah. Sorry, little dragonfish.
some pretty weak stuff here. Think there'd be so many. How old are you? 42. What about you? 41, if I remember right. Damn, that makes me feel old. Hey, age ain't nothing but a number. We got something better. Passion. Oh, passion, sure. I'm telling you, you are ready to work. You know what, these other losers? <sighs> Matsuo san, I can smell the liquor on you. To be considered for a placement being sober is mandatory. Please come back. Bitch. Like I'll ever come here again. Next, please. Yes, ma'am. I'm ready and able. You left your current residence blank. Because I don't have one right now. But I'm committed to working. And I don't drink, by the way. Well, normally you need an address, but... I think we can make an exception. So, I'm hired? Just write the address of where you grew up. Oh, but... Uh, I don't have an address for that either, actually. Have you always lived on the streets? I'd like to refer you to our support center then. What's that? It's where you can get a check- But, wait. I don't need all- Sorry, but that's our policy for people- Please, ma'am! I'll work real- I'm sorry. Next, please! Wait, hold on a minute. I need to- Hey, out- <laughs> No residence, no work. So, did you- Shut up. They didn't like me either. <laughs> For a hobo, when God closes a door, it closes a window while he's at it. Well, fellas, we tried, right? Any other losers want to go and get a drink? John R. Sara? We're not losers. We're gonna try something else. Ah, uh, oh, don't fool yourself. I can tell you're homeless like me. <laughs> this was such a waste of time. I could have been doing something productive, like fishing. Get salty yet? I can figure this out. Hey, either of you guys looking for? Yeah, tried at the desk. But they don't give jobs at the home. Tough break. So I assume you're still looking. Right? Yep. I think we gotta try to look less unemployable. You don't look so unemployable to me. <laughs> <laughs> Filthy one. But hey, thanks for noticing. You're a man of. T so you guys interested in doing some work tonight? Huh? I'm not the one hiring, but there's this bar on the other side of the Sakura River. It's called the Harbor Light. The mama there needs a job done by a couple of guys tonight. What's the job? Bartending? I don't know what it is, but I know it pays 5,000 yen. Pretty good money, huh? Hey. 
Yeah, it is. 